Hi friends, we have this example. We have a pole with the base area 6.1 multiply 6.1 meter and the height of the pole is 1.52 meter. We have a hole at the bottom of the pole. Within 10 days, we have a data for precipitation and evaporation. And also, the water level at the first and at the last day of the period is recorded. We have to find the volume of seepage. We see that the days and the data for evaporation, also the data for precipitation and water level. Water level at the first day is 1.52 uh, 152 centimeter. At the last day is 132. The difference is 20 centimeter. Let's solve it. Water budget calculation. General water budget equation is input summation of input minus summation of output equal to uh, change of, uh, of storage. Okay. Input is the precipitation and output is evaporation and seepage equal to change of storage. We have 10 days and water loss uh, or height of water, change of height of water is 1.52 meter minus 1.32 meter equal to 0.2 meter which equal 20 centimeter and the summation of precipitation is 1.75 centimeter summation of evaporation is 0.875 centimeter if we put the, uh, the data in the equation precipitation minus evaporation plus seepage equal to change of storage Precipitation is 1.75 cm minus 0.875 evaporation plus seepage equal to minus 20. Minus because uh, the level of water is decreased. Only seepage is unknown. So seepage equal to minus 20.87 cm. We lost minus 20.87 0.875 centimeter for 10 for 10 days but daily seepage is 0.020875 meter per day if you want to find the volume we have to multiply this number by the area of the pool the base dimension for pool is 6.1 multiply 6.1 so 0.0209 multiply 6.1 multiply 6.1 is 0.777 meter cube per day. That is the volume of seepage for every day. Have, have a nice time.